and welcome back as we continue our journey into the realm of the LSD Dream Emulator. Let's begin our next session. Well, the music seems upbeat in this dusk-like environment. Or perhaps it's morning. Early morning or late evening. I'm not sure. I don't know where they're off to. They won't talk to me. They act as if I don't exist. But they seem hell-bent on getting wherever they're going. Perhaps I can accompany them. If only for a brief while. seems as if they're heading towards this. Is it a temple? Or is it something more? But in they go. Perhaps we should follow. And at the end of the tunnel, pastures once again. Perhaps this is the free realm of our psyche, of our thoughts. The great matrix which ties everything together, which unifies our emotions, our feelings. And any other description that you could use to describe what makes us us. tree, like a slingshot, but without a band of rubber. They're so massive compared to the rest, and I didn't think I was so close to you before. Is there a way to climb? I want to I want to climb ever so high, but we're back here, in the atmosphere, the feeling, the tone, I feel like there's something suspenseful going on, you, you return, but you elude me once again, why, for what reason do you exist? Why? I hear something. What is making that noise? Is it my destiny? Where did you come from? Paradox. Cow pulling a rickshaw. There is no other way to describe this scene. I want to escape. But our escape takes us here. Once again, it fits the water. Rather than swimming, we end up becoming transported once more. There is no escape from this hell. I feel frozen. Perhaps this is my true purpose. To be impaled by the bull's horns. But death is not so swift. It is repetitive not let me just go in peace. It wants to make sure I have to live forever in this 
this realm of purgatory. That sound. Another sound. Something screaming in the air. I hear you, but I cannot see you. Where are you? What are you? Are you friendly or are you hostile? I feel cowardly. As if I should have stayed. As if I should have waited. As if there was a purpose. A sign of life. The endless desert. An eagle swarms. Where does it soar? Are you trying to tell me something? Am I on the right path? The closer I get, the further I feel like I am away. We've been here. But where's our friend? The balancing friend. The one who was on the chairs. Did we kill her? Was our prank something that went way too far? No. Is this her? Has she finally decided to become more social? Irregardless. And that's where we end up. Not sure if we're doing good or if we're doing terrible. It's really kind of hard to say. Well, that dream on its own was a good seven minutes. Well, we don't necessarily need to see that again. One of the game's many intro screens. I suppose now would be as good a time as any to save. saving. Saving is progression. And how else will you get to further understand the marvels of your mind? Unless you're able to keep a living track diary of them. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure what I meant by that. It probably had some sort of meaning in my head, but... Nah. So once again, this has been Let's Play LSD Dream Emulator, and I've been Mike Mnemonic. I still am Mike Mnemonic, but will I continue to be myself? Playing this game, I guess I could be anybody, anywhere. So, I'll see you later. Perhaps. I don't know. Because I don't know if anyone's actually watching this stuff. This game is really one of those things you either like or hate. If you hate it, well... I don't know when I'm going to get the Martian Gothic, so... Oh well. See you later.